hey my loves welcome or welcome back to my channel hi if you are new here and welcome my name is karen i can't believe we are at the end of the year guys i'm very happy and blessed that we have made it by the way today's video is being sponsored by anna luisa and they are having a big end of the year sale so make sure you check them out if you're looking to revamp your wardrobe for the new year or looking to give something special for a loved one anna luisa has a wide selection of pieces for you to choose from be sure to keep watching my video for more details and i'll be sharing my discount code with you all if you happen to miss their end of the year sale It's carnival. I need to go to a carnival so bad, okay? Real bad, real bad. Good morning, guys. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys for tuning in. I know it's been wow two weeks since i've posted really and truly um your girl has been caught up in so much since i've tested negative and i recovered from covid i've been back to work but they've been working me like a dog y'all and we've been short staffed so i've been picking up hours and really and truly i need to put the pause on that because i've been working so hard my back has been killing me and i just haven't been in the mood to pick up the camera and i've just been so busy that my days have been going and i haven't been able to create content um and on top of it the weather has been really bad it's been picking up we are in winter now and by me just recently we had a bad flood i personally wasn't affected but in my area it was tons of flooding a lot of cars unfortunately were damaged by the water and i wasn't able to really go anywhere so i couldn't like you know go out about my day and pick up the camera and then i don't know just with the holidays i've been kind of in a deep depression today i get news that my son's father had another child all this time had another child and i'm thinking to myself like already noah's experiencing neglect from the other side and now he's he's not ever gonna get that attention that he needs from that other side and not so much that he needs but that i would want for him because it's just not fair to him at all of course i do the best that i can i'm trying to do my best to establish myself and get myself situated so that way he is taken care of i want the best for him i don't want him to ever be in a situation where he's in a nursing home or you know somebody's taking advantage of him i'm sorry y'all i'm just I get so sensitive over my son as anybody would and I know a lot of people look up to me and say I have a lot of strength but I have to tell you guys I fight my silent battles every single day every single day I don't disclose it I don't share it I keep a smile on my face I keep a pushing I can say that I really I hold myself together for the most part and I'm strong but there is a breaking point there's a breaking point and we lose it you know we lose it after time but um whew, i didn't plan on getting on here and just breaking down y'all <laughs> and this is a sponsored video <laughs> okay um but i just i have to be transparent with you guys like i am not one of those to get on here and fake how i feel but you know i, I kind of want to take it easy and i have to fall back sometimes so if you guys do not see me it's because I'm going through something. Just know I'm going through something. But anyways, y'all. I'm hoping that everybody had a good Christmas. And got everything that they wanted. And if you don't celebrate the holidays. I'm hoping that you guys are still doing well. Everybody's okay. Um, I had a great Christmas. My mom got some things for me that I wasn't able to get for her before. So I was really happy. Like hard work pays off. Because she's doing a lot for me watching Noah. 
and same with my grandmother and my sister Jordan I got her some stuff that she was really happy about and my other family members and friends I was able to get them some things so I feel like I had a good holiday in that sense all right guys I figured I will show you all what I got for Christmas or at least a few things that I got for Christmas before I put them away because I need to clean up my spot I'm not gonna do this now I'm gonna be doing some cleaning for the new year within the next possibly three days I love to have a clean space period but I cannot go into the new year like this like it looks crazy in here um so to start off I have some Chloe here which girl we don't need any more perfume okay and I I love the way that this one smells. Oh my God, I almost broke my nail. Okay, we're struggling. It doesn't want to come out. The bottle is beautiful. <laughs> Next up, I got some more perfume, which I don't need, y'all. This is the Byretto. I'm actually gonna open it right now for you guys on camera. I haven't smelled all the perfume from Byretto, but this one, I smell this store. I'm so happy I got it. So this is what it comes like. This is a big box, y'all. My thing is I really need to just have one perfume. Like I like the YSL Libre. I love how it smells on me. I get compliments all the time. I just feel like I need to stick to a signature and I have so many perfumes because I have so many and I don't wear them all. Recently, I've been wearing the Prada that I showed you guys on my last video and it smells really nice on me as well. Oh my gosh, look how big this bottle is. <sighs> this thing is huge. Okay, so this is a 3.3. I was gonna say it smells like florals, but that's the name of it. It's the Young Rose, and oh my gosh, y'all. I'm obsessed, I'm obsessed. I also got the Burning Rose candle. I have a lot of candles, y'all. A lot of them. I need to burn the candles that I have. Oh, it's so cute and petite. You guys can see it. Now, next up, this is a gift that I bought myself. I actually already have been using it. This is the YSL card holder. I bought my mom one as well. She has the all black, all matte. Really, really cute. It has these pockets here and here and then one in the middle. And I really needed a card holder because when I go to work, I can't carry a bulky wallet in my scrubs. And this can just slip right in my pocket. So I was like, you know what? Let me just be a little bougie and treat myself. I was trying not to. It was very hard to not shop for myself this Christmas. I just felt like I was deserving of it. Like I worked hard. Also what I got myself, I got this bath time set from Primark. Primark is that girl, y'all. It is that girl. It has this little scooper here and some Epsom salt. And it's so funny because I said to myself, I need to go to Target today because I need some more Epsom salt. But I'm going to use this set hopefully tonight. shower and I'm about to do my makeup real quick just something simple cuz I'm going out I don't want to look super tired I have a primer this is the milk primer I've been using it for a while and it's been holding up I mean the many times that I've used it I haven't had any issues the way it just sets on your face I love it I am going to be using this CC cream it is from it cosmetics I think I am blind I'm just gonna use it as like my little foundation because I have like red spots on my face so y'all do you guys have any resolutions for the new year like is there anything that you would like to change work on I want to lose weight first and foremost I've been putting myself on a back burner I did work out actually before I hopped in the shower so that's my goal um but on the flip side 
there are some things that I want to change about myself that I'm not going to disclose right now but <clears throat> I know that the same patterns won't get me anywhere so I gotta switch it up and then another thing is I just want to be more intentional with my channel when I'm producing content I want there to be something to come from this because I don't want to just do my day-to-day -day. I don't feel like there's a lot going on so I want to make it worthwhile for you guys to watch my channel I mean I'm surprisingly still getting traction and you guys watch the majority of my videos which is good but I just wish I was more consistent with my content because I know I'd be going somewhere and I know I would be a lot further than what I am. Ooh, I just like poke myself. I want to be more consistent with my content and intentional, like I said. So where's the Dior? Say he calling from Atlanta, say he missed me. Well, well, well. And one last thing I have to worry about is my eyebrows. You guys don't know I had my eyebrows microbladed a couple of months ago. So if you guys see that my eyebrows are literally always done, that's why. I was looking at my old videos and I was like, oh my god, my eyebrows look so crazy. I wanted to delete the videos. Like, don't tell my eyebrows were struggling. Like, oh no. Now, why did I just realize that I had a big old pimple right here? I just tried to pop it. It was so hard and it still feels hard. Like, I don't know what is going on, but I think it's because of the mass and the string. Because the string is always right here. Oh my gosh, that is not cute all right so now i'm gonna get into my accessories for what i'm wearing today these are like my go-to necklaces these are from anna luisa you guys know like i only wear anna luisa i don't have any other jewelry actually i've been wearing anna luisa since i started my channel actually I'm trying to see where the clasp is this one is called the shea necklace yes oh this is so pretty y'all this bracelet is from Anna Luisa and then I also have these two rings here I can't remember the name of these as well but I'll leave a link for them love the way that it's shaped it's really really pretty and I love minimal jewelry like this because it goes with everything and then as I age I know that I'm gonna wear this jewelry it never gets old to me I just feel like it's worth investing in and actually this jewelry is really affordable because it starts at $39 and up I want to say on average I spend about 40 maybe 45 if you guys are in need of any jewelry definitely check them out I mean I've actually bought jewelry in the past from my friends and my family I'm gonna give this necklace to one of my best friends I have the same necklace this is going to be my last minute Christmas gift so be sure to check my description I'll leave a link for the website below and a discount code for you guys to save on jewelry if you have to do any last minute shopping or you just want to treat yourself sis check it out okay you guys this is my outfit that i am wearing for today and y'all forgive me for my background it looks crazy in my apartment but we are gonna clean this sooner or later right now i'm just gonna focus on this outfit so i have this coat here from primark that i just got recently it's a hound's tooth coat and the quality is amazing y'all it has this tie here so i can belt it i have on this turtleneck that i either got from h&m or zara very nice material i have on my favorite bag i really want to get the real one at this point but i just don't see myself spending five thousand dollars on the bag but this is my fotega and i'm gonna leave a link for this below i'm so obsessed with this bag so obsessed it's just the perfect bag i wear this every chance that i get also i have on these leather leggings that i got from shop Bop. and lastly i'm wearing my mcqueen sneakers because the booties that i had y'all the bottom is missing i messed up my booties the last time i went out for brunch so i don't know what happened but we're gonna wear these also i forgot to mention the perfume that i am wearing today is from prada and this one smells amazing y'all this is becoming my favorite okay let's pack this bag real quick i'm gonna carry this glam glue just in case my nails pop off my necessaire lotion is a must um my sunglasses just in case and then my phone which i need to get a new cover for and my YSL card holder. Get the keys. Alrighty. And extra batteries because my camera is dying.
at my mom's house, but I don't know if she'll actually use it. But it was cute, and it was only five dollars. Come on, what are you doing? Um, oh shit! If you guys were flying, it's because I'm on this curve. Um, but yeah, it wasn't all well, that. At least this one ah, that I went to. Oh my god, guys! <laughs> I needed to put you guys on a stable surface not working I had this little tripod piece that I literally taped to my car and it held my camera but I took it off because it just looks so damn ghetto I'm gonna have to order something off of Amazon and try to make it work because this is why I have my camera kind of like free falling off of my dashboard because it's not stable all right let me um talk to you guys when I get in so y'all, I just came back home and I look at my nails. I didn't even realize that I broke this nail. It's a sign that it just needs to come off at this point, but they were cute while they lasted. I didn't do the best job putting them on and it's probably the glue that I was using too. And it was a little rough, but it's cute when you just need to be on and go and just wanna have your nails done. All right, you guys, I went to Target and I found a jewelry box and it's a little dirty. I'm gonna see if I can clean it up, but it is nice. So I have something to put my jewelry in. And this is what I was telling you guys about this little doggy treat ball. Like how cute is this? I want a dog. I want a dog here so bad, but I'm not home enough. I can't even take care of the child that I got and here I am, I want a dog. This is a canister, it's like how cute. I'm gonna speak this into existence that I get a house and I have a nice cute little dog. The only thing different was I saw this Khalifa peppermint mocha latte. So I can't wait to try this, I cannot wait. I hope it tastes good. I already bought some coffee earlier, but I saw that and I was like, yeah, we gotta have that. And I picked up the Dr. Teal, but they have this one with elderberry and I've never seen this one. This is a new one. I'm gonna try this. Hopefully tonight I can take a bath and relax. I'm not gonna get into everything that I got honestly because it's not even really worth showing. Hey y'all, so I just changed my clothes and I was actually about to start cooking, but your girl is tired. So now I'm on Uber Eats and I'm debating what I'm going to eat. Debating if I'm gonna get Chinese food, which I really don't want, or get Dominican food, but the Dominican place close early because i don't see it here on over eve everything is so damn expensive like i'm gonna pay ten dollars for a little taco like why i think i'm just gonna play it safe and get some chinese food because that's the cheapest option so i think i'm just gonna get chicken wings and i'm debating if i'm gonna get french fries or fried rice honestly i think i'm gonna get french fries Um, I'm supposed to have food. They drip me. <sighs> Super random. Back in the day when I attended junior high school, there was a Chinese restaurant literally right down the block from my house. And I used to go there to get a bag of chicken wings and french fries. Y'all, it used to hit every single time. All right, you guys, I am about to take a bath because I want to unwind and I'm starting to have cramps. So I'm thinking it's about to be that time, unfortunately. I'll let you guys know how this works out for me. I'm also going to use my new bath set that I got from Primark that I showed you guys. And I also have this Epsom salt that I bought from Target not too long ago by June and Moon. I like it so far. So yeah, let's get into this montage. Hey you guys, welcome to another day in the vlog. I slept so good last night, y'all. 
I haven't slept that good in a long time. I don't know if it had anything to do with the Dr. Teal's Epsom salt, but my body just felt so relaxed. I slept for hours. It's after eight o'clock right now and I never sleep in that late. Um, I didn't do much else last night. The Chinese food that I had was okay. It wasn't really a hit, but I wasn't expecting much out of fried chicken and french fries. Um, I'm definitely gonna be starting a new vlog after this. So definitely stay tuned because I'm gonna be doing like a home reset. I have so much cleaning that I need to do for my apartment for the new year because I hate to go into the new year with a dirty house. By the way, forgive me for looking like a hot mess, but I literally just woke up. My hair has been up in a bun since last night because yeah. I have nothing else to do with it. I plan on getting my hair done for the new year as well. We have some changes, y'all. I'm gonna be changing the look. But in the meantime, I have some things that I bought from Target yesterday that I did not put away. But I'm gonna put away right now. And also the jewelry box that I showed you guys. I'm gonna clean it up a little bit and start putting my jewelry away. You guys can see all the crap that I have on my table that I got from Target. Um, but this is the jewelry box and I'm gonna start putting my jewelry away, but I'm gonna make myself a coffee because I cannot function right now. something oh my gosh it is coming she is coming with full force i took another boomerang by the way y'all and i'm about to post it can you guys even see so that's what i wrote all right enough of my shenanigans we are going to put some jewelry away i showed you guys this jewelry box that i got from target i just wiped it down with a regular baby wipe and the scuff marks that were on here they're not as visible so i'm not freaking out this is what it looks like inside so i finally have somewhere to put my jewelry all right you guys i have all of my jewelry out on my bed looking like a hot damn mess some of my necklaces are all twisted up. It's driving me crazy. I can't wait to put them in my jewelry box. But dumb me, I had these pouches from Ana Luisa that I didn't use. I took my jewelry out of the pouches. When they come in their individual pouches and they keep the jewelry safe and untangled. So guys, when you're ordering, just know that you're gonna have sustainable packaging that's gonna keep your jewelry safe and tarnish free. And these are great for traveling as well. But you guys see how many pouches I have. Like I have enough to put my necklaces in there so they won't get messed up. For right now, we are going to transfer the jewelry that I have out into this little jewelry box. So we're going to do this together. all right you guys i am done putting my jewelry away but i have these two necklaces that are all tangled up and i am struggling right now that's why it's so important to take apart your jewelry and put them in their own packaging just so you can preserve the lifeline of your jewelry here I am like these are my two favorite necklaces and I don't know what the heck is going on here but <laughs> girl we are struggling and I don't want to go through this I have these nails on and I'm ready to take them off but it might be easier since I have the nails on to do this now if this was cheap jewelry guys this would have already broken honestly because I have struggled with jewelry being all tied up and as soon as you try to take it apart, it rips. So we have some good jewelry here, y'all. I 
All right, you guys, another nail just came off, but I'm happy because I'm gonna take them off anyway and get my nails done. But I was able to achieve the layered look. And that's the thing, when you're getting these necklaces, you kind of want to get different materials. You don't want to get the same size necklace as well. But the great thing is that Ana Luisa has the necklace extenders. So if you need to purchase, they have them here, you guys can see. And then they also have jewelry cleaner, so that way you can protect your jewelry, which is dope. I think I'm gonna buy that for myself as well. So yeah, this is the look that I'm going for right now. I have my initial and my Sagittarius necklace and we are good to go. So again, be sure to check out Anna Luisa while they have a sale. And if you happen to miss the holiday sale, I still have you guys. I'm gonna leave my discount code in my description box. And again, if you guys are looking for last minute gifts or something for yourself, they have something for everybody, okay? So I thank you guys for tuning in. Thank you, Anna Luisa, for sponsoring this video. I hope you guys subscribe to my channel. Hit that notification bell as well, so that way you guys know when I upload. And I will see you guys in the next one.